The MagTest software by Schwarzberg Mass Electronic is a tool for magnetic field immunity testing according to several different standards. In uh, this series of uh, video tutorials, we will show you how to configure the software and uh, how to connect the different parts of the experimental setup in order to perform um, a test. In particular, in uh, this uh, first part, we will show you the basic details uh, and configuration of uh, our magnetic field uh, software. This is how the software looks like once it is uh, started. In the upper part of the screen there is uh, a menu which uh, allows you to set up different uh, options that we will see much more in details in the following uh, episodes and uh, a bar for the operation. Then uh, the screen is divided in two parts. The upper part uh, is dedicated to the details of the tester and the um, components that are connected uh, to the system and this is very useful to summarize all uh, the details. The second part is a plot which shown the magnetic field level, in this case in a bar, bar meter, as a function uh, of the increasing frequency shown here in uh, kilohertz. In the plot uh, we can see a curve that uh, is uh, defined by a very well uh, defined uh, magnetic field uh, standard. In the right part of the screen uh, we can uh, see a legend which uh, summarizes the color for the different uh, magnetic field uh, measuring devices that are connected to the system. Now we will go much more in detail uh, in the menu of uh, our uh, magnetic field uh, software. In particular we can open the file uh, menu and open previous uh, saved uh, testing. You can also have the option to print uh, the actual uh, configuration and to set up the printer. And uh, of course we can also save the result of our test in uh, text format or as a function uh, of uh, an image. Then in the second part it is also possible to set uh, other characteristics that we will uh, show to you in the next episodes. The edit menu is very important because uh, it allows you to define the limits. In this case you can see that several uh, magnetic uh, testing uh, limits according to several normatives are already saved in our menu and you can just select the one that you wish to use. In particular, a very well-defined standard uh, defines the frequency and the corresponding uh, level in uh, ampere per meter or in different units of measurement. In this case you can see the frequency on the left uh, of the panel and the corresponding uh, field strength in decibel per ampere per meter, decibel picotesla or ampere per meter. In this case you can also have the option to set up uh, your own uh, limit according to your own uh, testing. In the second uh, part of our video we will see how to set up the signal source. Here uh, you can see the corresponding panel. This uh, is a very detailed and we will uh, show to you in the next episode as well as the voltmeter that are connected to the system. Then it is also possible to insert uh, different comments, for example the name of your company, the department, the name of the tester and some uh, additional information. In this case you can uh, write for example text for a uh, tutorial. Then we can uh, set up the GPIB interface. We have different options. We will also see this uh, in the following episode. And uh, we can uh, change uh, some setting for the cosmetic uh, end view. We can change, for example, the range 
changing the limit of the frequency here for example I change the frequency domain zooming inside the plot and you can see that the situation is changed you can uh, change uh, the color of the devices that are connected to the to the setup for example you can change the color of uh, the measuring loop in order to see it uh, better and then you can also have the option to change uh, the sizes of the legend for the test that uh, represent the informative for the testing and uh, for the legend on the x and the y axis then uh, there is this very important hardware configuration uh, menu that we will see much more in detail in the following parts it is very important and it allows you to configure all the experimental setup and finally there is a, a very simple help that uh, also allows you to trace the actual version of our uh, software so basically here we have the a panel for the operation and uh, this is all for this uh, first part in which we shown the basic feature of our software and then the second part of uh, our um, tutorial will be dedicated to the configuration of the hardware that is connected to the computer.